number one and sheep number two. And uh, I've got everything growing right here inside the uh, little greenhouse place I built last episode. So we got some melons, we got some pumpkins, we got a lot of wheat, and um, some carrots. So that's good. And there's one more thing I want to show you guys. So let me just splash down here. Okay, so we have a pet horse now, if I'll show you guys this. So here he is. I haven't named him yet. Um, if you guys have a cool name for a horse, leave it in the comments below. Um, I don't know what to name this guy, but he's got that cool golden armor we found inside a uh, dungeon. So yeah, so let me get up here. Oh, come on. Okay, so it is kind of annoying to here. I'll just go slash home. That, that'll be easier. And the reason I have these huge waterfalls here is so that I can have a way for people to get up if they want to come to my house for any reason. I mean, I was told by Burning Tempers to put those in because it was annoying. So this episode I'm going to be building the animal farm. So it's going to be another speed build, um, looks like Unlucky Seeker just left. Um, I don't have everything I need yet, so I will have to go run a few errands to go get some stuff. Like, I mean, uh, I do need grass, which will be a pain to get up here. I'll have to, yeah, I'll have to find a way to do that. So, hmm. Alright, do I have enough dirt to do that? Let me check. I've got 10, 12, that won't be nearly enough. Uh, anything in there? In there, we got 13. Shut up, guys, man. This is the most annoying thing ever. Alright, I'm gonna go get some dirt, so I'll be right back. Okay, so this is what I've got set up here. I've got this small little platform here with the caterpillar project going down, so I guess we could call this the grass caterpillar project, so the GCPP. Alright, and so if we go all the way down here to the bottom of the thing, you can see that the grass is starting to caterpillar up, so I'll probably just leave my account idle until the grass gets all the way up but um yeah so look at that it's pretty big and I also downloaded OptiFine so it lets me just look around like that zoom in and stuff so yeah um let me go back up to the house and I guess I'll start the speed build alright teleportation will commence in five seconds I think these shaders look great by the way like look at that even like the little animations and like from the sky even like I'll just take a second here to show you guys like this looks awesome like Amazing. Alright, well, uh, I guess I will go do a bit of gathering just to get some materials I need. Um, the farm will not be like the this uh, greenhouse over here. It's more going to be just like a wooden uh, frame with just glass around it to like grass, uh, glass windows, sorry, and just some different pens where I can store animals and stuff. Um, let's see, are the sheep still here? Okay, cool, they didn't despawn. Alright, I will be right back.
I just finished building the barn. I guess I'll call this the barn. Um, and actually, I think one of the sheep fell off uh, while I was building this, so it will never be forgotten, sheep. But this sheep is the veteran. He's the one that stayed alive, and he will be one of the two sheep. I'll have to go get another one off camera. So, yeah, um, I'll get all the animals off camera, so we'll have chickens here, pigs here, cows here, and then obviously the sheep over there. And yeah, so I'm waiting for the, I'm also waiting for the grass caterpillar up, so I guess I'll show you guys that real quick. If I run down here, down here. Now my voice might sound a little bit raspy, it's because I just got up. Um, I actually built this between two days, because I got kind of bored yesterday, so I logged out. So, it is a very slow progress, so, um, I will be here a really long time before there's grass up there, so that'll, that'll suck, but whatever. Um, might be able to get a silk death pickaxe by that point. So yeah, ah, that bloom effect is ridiculous. Alright, um, I guess that's going to be it for this episode, so thanks for watching guys. As always, if you could leave a uh, uh, like or subscribe, that would be much appreciated for more Journey to the End. So yeah, um, if I could reach 5 likes, that would be really cool. So yeah, I guess I'll see you guys next time.